damn it. <laughs> I'd totally watch Matt Plant. Uh, I don't know if I'd watch Matt Pat for that. That being said, it would make for a fun video though. Like these guys, these skeletons throwing their, you know, body. Uh, that worked, I think. I had 41 there. Jumpman Mario. Hello, welcome to another episode of Game Theory. Yeah, his voice. I, I used to like Game Theory a lot when it came out. So, and Matt Pat, yeah, he does have a good voice. And he seems like a pretty good dude, too. I just don't quite dig the content anymore. Got a little too ridiculous, you know. That was so bad. Yeah, see, that's the thing, is like, I, I used to watch it back when it was taken a little seriously. Then at that point, he started, he started just like making dumb stuff up. Yes. So glad I can get that trick first try now. So satisfying. What is the game of the year? I'm so glad you asked. Uh, it's easily Death Stranding, duh. Haven't you seen how cool that game is? How how cool it is that you spend, you know, 40 hours to get story? I really can't comment too much on Death Stranding because I have not quite looked into a lot of stuff about it. I just know I've, I've heard some decent complaints, uh, but I've also heard a lot of people really praise it. That being said, you know, Death Stranding being up for like 10 awards at the Game Awards is a little funny, because, you know, Jeff and Kojima are BFFs, but, uh, yeah, I, for me it's easily Resident Evil 2. That game is a masterpiece. Training is an Amazon delivery simulator, right? Also, hi Matt. Thanks for coming by. Um, what happened? No. It's a little slow, but it's good. I didn't get poisoned. That would have been Ripper, you know. And Matt, by the way, it's not an Amazon delivery dude. It's a pizza delivery dude. All right, get it right. Ah, uh, oh damn. Come on. But wasting my time. Yeah, see, I, it is kind of the thing that I would maybe rather watch. Especially because, uh, you know, like, there's 10 hours of cutscene. I didn't think Kojima could do more than Metal Gear 4, but here we are. Yeah, basically, like, I'm a Kojima fan. Kojima just needs to make a fucking movie already. That's what he wants to do. Just let him do it. He didn't chicken out of RE2. We just never played more of it. You're welcome to play more of it whenever you want. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, Resident Evil 2 was the best game to come out this year. Uh, underrated game of the year is Devil May Cry 5, though. That game is amazing, and I love it, and it's great, and you guys are just mean. 
but DMC5 is only up for two awards at the Game Awards. And it might honestly lose Action Game to Modern Warfare, which would be the saddest thing I think I've ever seen. But that and it's up for music, <clears throat> but it's going up against Cadence of Hyrule, and that's like literally the music game. So Cadence is gonna win. I even voted for Cadence, because I think it deserves it more. But it's just, it's a damn shame. Because the DMC5 soundtrack is also really, really good. But, uh, besides that, I think, if, if we're talking about the game awards specifically, instead of just what, what I think is the best game of the year, uh, Smash Brothers is easily gonna win. It's, it's Smash Brothers, like, come on, everybody and their grandma plays Smash, and, like, Ultimate is really, really good, it's really well put together, but, like, when you have a game like RE2, which is wholly, you know, I want to say, even though it's a remake, it's just, like, it's gameplay style. Like, every single time Capcom makes a new horror game, they set the fucking bar. Like, you know, Resident Evil 7 set the bar for uh, first-person horror again now. And it brought it back into the mainstream. Really just horror in the mainstream in general. It's like, the, the biggest horror game, you know, before uh, RE7 was, like, Outlast. Or a Alien Isolation, you know. Which, those are, I mean, at least Alien is really good, but, like, 7 is just on such a higher tier. Um, so, <clears throat> the, yeah, um, Resident Evil 2 is, like, just, I think there's so much love put into that game. I mean, there's love put into both games, but, uh, I don't know, I feel like, I feel like, uh, RE2 is more important for, you know, for gaming overall, especially the horror genre, which is not very popular, you know. Fuck me. DMC5, Luigi's Mansion 3. I'd have to think uh, about that. I think I would put um, Ritual of the Night above uh, Luigi's Mansion 3, even though I really, really liked Luigi's Mansion. Um, Virtual of the Night is up there, uh, Modern Warfare, is that, is that the obvious answer? Oh, KH3, right, how could I forget? Square's best game. They did it. <laughs> Nomura really did it. He really gave up on that game and decided to work on FF7. God bless him for it, because FF7 is looking beautiful. No. Oh. Hey, <laughs> look, you told me you're not excited for the, the KH3 DLC, dude? Come on. You're not a real fan if you're not excited for that. Let's go! Oh my god, I'm fucking zooming. That was fast. That was really good. Ow. <laughs> oh my god, just just like the DLC is just Union X, but on a uh, frickin' PS4. That would be, that'd be real gamer strats right there. Yeah, page 3 is, page 3 makes me sad. In fact, like, like, <laughs> I have totally forgot about Cage 3 after I played it because I just, you know, was like, as soon as I was done with Cage 3, I was like, okay, time to, fuck you, time to go back to, um, uh, RE2, because RE2 came out, like, four days before it, I think. So, time to go back to this better game. No. What 
the fuck? <laughs> Whatever. Alright, we're gonna lose time. Cool. No. <laughs> no. Oh, yeah, we're gonna lose time. Ooh. Yikes. I get this first try, then we can. Cool. Take a moment to appreciate the Ari engine. Mm. Mwah. They've done so much good with it, and I can't wait to see what uh, Resident Evil 3 remake comes out like that's the thing fucking three remake is happening you guys the guys like if you thought re2 was good fucking nemesis is gonna be the greatest horror game ever made like goddamn nemesis is terrifying you thought mr x was bad mr x is a fucking baby compared to nemesis Never felt more disappointment than page three. Oh god, yeah, okay. Oh, that was fast. Hell yeah. I'll do one wing smash here. Okay. Yeah, like, okay, the the, the it, it's kind of our faults for getting really excited for it. But luckily I knew that I wasn't gonna like the gameplay going in. So instead, I just decided to focus solely on story, and then I was still disappointed. It's just that meme of, I expect nothing and I'm still let down. God, the movie adaptation? <laughs> no! Oh, that was so close. Shit. That was almost Ripperina run. You're what? Alright, let me. I'm interested in this. I'm interested in this. Alright, the. Okay, the Nemesis movie is the best one in the series because it is the, like, most cheesy fun one. I'm interested in this. Thank you. Farewell for now. Yes, you. Like, I, I just watched the, all the Resident Evil movies somewhat recently, it was like this year, and yeah, from, from what I remember, that one was easily the best, then probably the first one, and then uh, whichever one straight up copies uh, Resident Evil 5, I think it's the fourth movie, maybe. it copies like everything from 5, to like fast moving Wesker, to like the Executioner dude, copies everything, it's hilarious. So, uh, to answer your question, Matt, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be, uh, just like RE2. Like, you know, I think, I think that just makes sense at this point. Like, that, that, everybody really loves, you know, Resident Evil in that style of behind the back. So I feel like they're gonna be like, yeah, that's, that's how we should do it. Now, given people think that, like, oh yeah, we did, we did remake one, uh, as the original survival horror, we did, uh, 
We did RE2 as the behind the back. Let's do RE3 as a first person, like seven, and I really doubt it's gonna be that. But, nice, nice bonk. Oh, no, PM is <laughs> Yeah, dude, get some sleep. Uh, thank you so much for being here, Daniel, and witnessing my PB. I love you. Have a good night. Mm. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta thank you guys in the chat right now, because you're really distracting me from this run, which is, like, making me play better. Much better. Let's see. Is that a gold? Yes, it is. Oh, it's a super gold. Fuck yeah. Woo! Okay. Anyways, yeah, the, the fact in the movie that they made Nemesis the, like, the, the typical, like, oh, he's a monster, but he still has his heart. Just, mwah, it's so beautiful. But it was hilarious. So, yeah, that one is the most fun, just because of it, how bad it is. Oh. Shield dashing probably would have been faster there, whatever. Yeah, Jill's redesign is going to be an interesting one. I really hope they give her the, uh, the skirt and the blue jacket outfit. That's not how video game nemesis is, but a disappointment. <laughs> I'm canceling my pre-order of Resident Evil 3 Remake. You really, you really screwed the pooch this time, Capcom. <laughs> nemesis needs to be relatable. <laughs> No! Okay, we're fine. Dude, this- I'm not gonna lie, this run is actually really good right now. I feel like I'm gonna choke at the end. Ugh. Can I get some hype in the chat? Uh, no. <laughs> uh, uh, come the chokes. Dude and dude. I'm gonna lose time here, but I can still PB. I don't think it's gonna be... I don't know, we'll see. I, I don't even wanna guess, we'll just- we'll see at this point. No! Oh shit, I, I dropped that input super hard. <laughs> the Heine Lick maneuver? Uh... I don't think that's, uh, what you think it is, mate. I hope that works. Oh, okay. Let's go. Oh man. This is it. This is the this is it. It's not gonna be sub 20, but damn, this is a good run. I believe in you and your bat form. Thanks for believing in both of us. <laughs> I could have soared, I got it right. I'm sorry, has, has Brayden taken over your account right now? These puns are awful. <laughs> Is this gonna be sub 20? No. No. No, it can't be. It can't be sub 20, not in the first night. No, it's probably going to be like one second off. Oh. 
still gonna be pretty fun to submit. Or like, subscribe for good content now. <laughs> subscribe for my uh, three hour review video analysis of uh, The Last Jedi. Oh shit. Go back <laughs> when you came. Trouble the soul of my mother no more. Oh, I, rep I messed up my Richter split. <laughs> I accidentally hit back. Uh, well, that's a PB though. <laughs> Literally like two seconds. So Still pretty good. <clears throat> I'll have to retime that though. Sorry. Or, no, I'm not. No, fuck that. I'm gonna beat this. Thank you, Serial, once again. Thanks for hanging out. Indeed. <sighs> you must 